what's up guys welcome back to the channel uh, today's video is about thinking about trading in my 2022 sr5 toyota tundra into a 2023 toyota tundra capstone when i purchased this track way back eight months ago there's no there's no track or any uh, floor model that you could check it out whatever like you know like because at that time like it's so hard to so hard to get a track right away right up front the the dealership so what happened is you have to uh you have to you know everyone everybody knows they have to put an order and then like it's so hard you could you could uh, i couldn't even uh, test drive it so I haven't seen a capstone. The only thing is just like I just I just go in YouTube and try to you know try to try to uh, understand and watch all those uh, videos about about tracks. So then three months after that, I purchased this one. I got this track because somebody canceled it, and yep, I got it. I got it uh, when I ordered it. My original order was wasn't the is that the SR5? It's not the SR5. It was the higher trim. It was supposed to be the the limited one, but somebody canceled this uh, this truck. So I got a call and they and they asked me if I wanted. So I really I really wanted so bad the truck because. I really need it on the things that I'm doing. So yeah, right, right away. So I got this track, but I haven't got, I haven't seen or test drive a, a capstone or the 1794 edition. So two weeks ago, I went to an auto show and I've seen this uh, capstone and I have, and I have been in the, try to sit inside the track. It was really nice like it's it's so luxurious and thing that I consider like it's so hard to you know like to to use a, a very nice track or or a top of the line like you know it's so it just to uh, use it for uh, just to use it as a work truck so yeah, I was, I was, I'm, I'm thinking about it now, trading it in, or rather to purchase the one, just for, uh, for leisure, uh, for uh, personal use, and not as a work truck. Because when I hop it in, it was like really nice. Like the truck is like you know, it's, it was like it's so crazy. Like it's just so luxurious, and when you hop in, it's like it doesn't feel like you're inside a, you're in a truck. Because uh, right now, like. Uh, like for this the SR5 that I have I really love it the truck is went beyond my expectation like for the SR5 it is a well equipped truck like I really love it like if some people like doesn't doesn't uh, like it so it's just uh, for me it's, it's a self uh, preference I've been using several uh, kinds of trucks and I just fell in love with this I just really love it. The SR5 is a well equipped. Like you know, I don't have any regret or or any issue about it. Uh, the only thing when I've seen the capstone, <clears throat> it is just so nice. Like you know, like I wanna, I really wanna wanna own one of that. Like like I'm thinking about it, but thing is like you know, it's so it's an expensive truck. We we all know that. And but. I'm thinking to to trade this in, or I'm just gonna lease that uh, truck, that capstone, or maybe you know so many things I I want to consider. So yeah, I need a I need a little help for that. If somebody owns a capstone or you know a Tundra or a, a truck uh, expert, do you think it's a it is a, a good. Uh, good purchase or it's a good uh, decision to trade this in and at the same time we're uh, using it as a work truck 
So because like uh, also one thing that I consider it's a hybrid. So there's no for sure like you don't have like for fuel efficiency that's gonna be nice as well. And I, as I've said the SR5, I love the track fuel efficiency. I don't have any issue about it. Well, we all uh, uh, track truck owners for sure like you know like like if if they purchase a truck or if you purchase a truck uh, truck so you expect that fuel is fuel is very impossible to you know like to have a few uh, like you know like to be efficient especially if you're towing uh, heavy loads all the time you're carrying heavy loads all the time so yeah one thing that I really consider is it's a hybrid track and TRD Pro is kind of you know it's it's also nice but it's just too much for like you know for me like you know I don't really go off-road or whatever but most of the time I use like you know I use a I tow a trailer for my for my other one of my other things that I've been doing, like uh, installing a deck or whatever, like you know, like like uh, home fixes. Whatever. So that's why I that's why I purchased this SR5, and also like you know, it was just like it's not a it's not a I don't have to wait for for six months or so to get a truck a brand new truck that time because like somebody canceled it or otherwise if I don't want it somebody's already waiting I know I know like I was I was a uh, I was a uh, I was like the like probably like like I was the number 17 of the line waiting for a truck but then the dealer was just so kind kind like you know like he called me if I wanted uh, if I want to see the truck if somebody cancel it or if I will come first and then they they will give it to me uh, and luckily there was uh, there were four guys that was uh, that's about to, uh, to come in that dealership and then it was a good thing that I came first to see it and then right away I said like okay I'm gonna get this truck and yep they give it to me and the three other uh, the four other guys they came they said it was it's already sold but they they allow him i allow him to go inside and check the truck and they really wanted to but i already got it so guys like you know like uh, please leave a comment down if you think it's worth it to trade this in or purchase that uh lease the truck or whatever purchase the truck as a personal use uh leave a comment down and also like you know like some other uh, uh, truck owners if you think that if you have experience with a capstone or uh, if you own a uh, capstone what do you think do you think it's more better and reliable or whatever like i don't know i really don't know but i'm so crazy of getting of getting that one so thinking about it but the the other guy told me that it probably you have to wait like for at least like eight months to get the one well at least like i still have my truck to use and then trade it in when the truck came so guys please leave a comment down or and subscribe and also don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you will be updated to the upcoming videos so all right see you on the next one ciao uh, this is the uh, 2023 the other Tundra capstone, which is the top of the line of this uh, pickup truck. It's like so 